that moment when you take off your glasses and then you can't fucking see where you left them. I can't see. They're under my stuff. Wow. I need to feel alive. Did I drop them on the floor? Ah. Girl. I got this shit. I found them. Yay. Oh, actually, no. I don't want to film with my glasses on because they're like window reflects in them. After all that. And I'm not even wearing them. Hi. Hi anyways. Hello. Oh. It's really, really hot today. And I don't want to have the window open because then people will hear me talking to myself. So I've got this shit that's broken. So today I sat here and I sat here and I sat here. And I thought of all these different ideas. But I'm just like, it's just not flowing. I'm just going to do like a collection thing of plushies. It's really boring, isn't it? I've already seen these ones, but hey ho, I've got Kiki and Lala, little twin stars. I've got a My Melody Sweetie Cushion by, I don't know, by a store. I can't remember. Charmy Kitty from eBay Thumper from Disneyland Paris. Corilla Kuma Cushion is actually one of those muffler thingies, whatever they're called, like. Why is it called a muffler? It sounds wrong. But yeah, you stick your hands in it. Um, and but it's massive. Like, why would you walk around with this? Well, maybe I should. I will next winter. So yeah, it's got some holes in there. Found this on eBay. This is like my kind of derp looking Hello Kitty. Like her eye keeps going wonky. She's from Cyprus, but I just like the pretty dress. This is my Marie plushie. From the Disney store. I was going to buy her out in Paris when I went. But they looked really derpy. And I was like I prefer the English one. So I had to wait till I came back. And then I bought her. And she is my fave. My babe. Uh, I've also got this Minnie Mouse cushion. That I've had for years. I've got loads of stuff from Disneyland. I've only just realised that. Ugh. This giant... <laughs> Girl, I stole myself out. This giant Rila Kuma. He's second hand, and I got him for £20, which is pretty good. Like, he's pretty... He's, like, half the size of me. So, yeah. And then he's got a giant zip at the back so that you can, like, pull out all his stuff in and give him a wash, but... Can you imagine, like, taking all that stuffing out and having to put it all the way back in again? Like, just leave him dirty. Who cares? But he's he's clean. He's clean. Aren't you, babes? And this is my fairy angel Hello Kitty that I found in a boot sale for £2. And then I was like, would you take it for one fifty? Because <laughs> I wanted to be one of those annoying people that's like, this is 50p, will you take it for 25 why? But I was like, let's see, let's just see if you know, they'll accept it. Because everyone does that to me when I do boot sales. So, and she was like, yeah. So, 150 for this. And I got this cinema roll. I barely have any cinema roll stuff. And he's so cute. I don't know what animal he's supposed to be. Is he a dog? Or some like, I don't even know. But he's really cute. And like, you rarely find anything with cinema roll on it. But I found this plushie at MCM. I have, well actually no, this is a cushion, but... I have this seashell cushion and it's got this iridescent thing. The material is quite like itchy and scratchy. Itchy and scratchy? Sounds like some characters from a show. Itchy and scratchy? Porky and scratchy. Scritchy and scratchy. Oh, is it that thing from The Simpsons? Yeah, itchy and scratchy. The cat and the mouse from The Simpsons. This is also from Disneyland Paris. I got a flounder. Because my favourite movie was... Well, actually, I had, like, three favourite movies. Number one was Lion King, then Aristocats, or Aristocats. How do you say I always said Aristocats, but everyone, some people say Aris, Aristocrats. Arist, Aristocats. Because it's... Because you say Aristocrat, don't you? You don't say Aristocrat. But, like, my mum and my nan and my dad were like, Aristocats. I don't know, 23 years of pronouncing it wrong, how sad. But yeah, then as I turned 
when I got to about eight. My favourite movie was The Little Mermaid 2. Two, number two, not, not the aerial one because I like the fact that she turned into a mermaid rather than a mermaid turned into a human because I was a little mermaid and her name was Melody and my name was Melissa and my mum was going to call me Melanie or Melissa so I was like a girl and like she had like the same colour hair as me and yeah I was like I'm basically Melody but I wanted something like uh, this was like when I went two years ago and I was just like oh the flounder looks really cute I do like the first one but I was like more of a fan of the second one but you can never find anything from the second one I want the little pendant that she has it's like a seashell and it says Melody on it I'm really cute. and oh my god I searched high and low for this plushie I only found it in one shop in the whole of Disneyland uh, and it was the hotel next to ours I was like oh it's fine I don't have to go to the uh, to the hotel like, I'm sure I could find it in the park couldn't find it anywhere so on the last day I was like we need to go back into the shop and I need that baby Pegasus and you can take off his little blanket which has a little lightning on it and he's got little wings and like look at him he's so cute Hercules isn't one of my favorites but I just thought this was adorable so yeah this is another one he's got like some curry stain on him <laughs> story of my life everything's covered in curry like i'm always covered in fucking katsu curry yeah here's another disney plushie that my dad bought me when i was about 12 or 13 and i was like obsessed with piglet this is my only alpaca that i have because i refuse to buy alpaca stuff because it's just got so overrated and there's just like so many fucking alpacas everywhere but i got this one for free so yeah, this is my pink alpaca from Love Jojo. I don't name my plushies, like some people are like, what should I name him? Should I name him Gregory or Bilbert or Gertrude? And I'm like, alpaca, bear, teddy, thing. Oh, what? Nah. I mean, the ones that do have names, obviously, like these ones, because his name is Pegasus, like, you know. But I. No. I don't want to name my plushies. I'm not five. I mean, look at my adult room. Like, I'm clearly so grown up. Who names their fucking plushies? Not me. And then I found this at MCM like three years ago. No, more than three years ago. It was when I was at uni and I was like, ah, I must have it. And it had like a Crash Bandicoot thing, but it was like a slinky and it was really weird. I was like, I don't want a slinky. I have a Spyro. Next, I need a Spyro onesie. Oh, actually, I do have some more Disneyland ones. These two I got when I first went to Paris when I was like nine with my family, as you can tell, like it's the France one. I think it was during the World Cup or something. She's wearing a football shirt, and I don't know why I chose this one. I don't even like football. That nine year old me was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I had to get the matching Donald as well. And then I had a collection of T.Y. teddies. Um, they were all really, really cute, but for some reason I just got rid of them all, which I wish I kept them because they would have been worth so much now. But I've only actually kept one of out of the, like, 20 that I had. Um, oh, why is it so... And this one is called Kiss Me. And it's... I just I wanted to keep it because it's all pastel and cute and it's got love hearts all over him. And then this... Girl, this plushie, okay. This is my most specialist, most bestest teddy ever. I'm never, ever, 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 ever getting rid of her. As you can see from the way she's all like, she's got no substance to her because I used to take her everywhere with me when I lived back in London. So I must have been about five or six. Um, I used to take her to school and she used to live here and I used to walk around with her like under my arm. And then my teacher was like, you can't bring her to school anymore. But she can stay in your tray, but you can't carry her around. And then I used to stick her in my drawer and I'd be like, I'll be back for you soon, okay? You're just going to have to sleep in here for a little while. But I promise at lunchtime I'll get you out and we can play. Yeah. And she's like very special to me. Hello. So those are the ones that are like near my bed. Um, and I've got loads like just dotted around my room. So I'll show you those loads. So here I have uh, Rilakkuma, which I got on eBay 
the Amuse Bunny, which I got from Kawaii Collective, and my Melody Sum Sum from Hyper Japan. Uh, this was just a store at MCM, and my friend got me that alpaca little purse. Got some more Amuse plushie dear. I love this brown one, it's so cute. This one's not as soft because it got dirty, and then my mum was like, I'll wash it. And I was like, mm, I think I'll ruin it. And she's like, No, I'll wash it. And then, yeah, it went like that. So I was like, oh. Girl, you're obsessed with washing shit. Um, I've got a purple hamster, another Amuse. And this is my collection of Simsums. Uh, the top three, I think they're like fake ones because I just found them on eBay for like £2, but I'm complaining. They're cute. And this was my first Sum Sum, of course. Minnie Mouse, Bambi, Thumper, Daisy, Donald, Marie, Eeyore, Dumbo, and Lady, of course. I have this fat cat here. I mean, how cute is it? It's, it's just so adorable. And then here I have my Gudetama, which I don't know what store it's from, but yeah, it's got the bum. Like, it needs to have the bum. If you're going to buy a Gudetama, he has to have the bum. I got a mini Rilakkuma, Mame Goma, which my brother bought me. I don't know why, because he hates Mame Goma. He, like, freaks him out. SpongeBob, Father Christmas Patrick, and a normal Patrick. And I've also got the Little Twin Stars Unicorn. It's the one that you can, like, wear around yourself, and it's got, like, a little purse. And it's very cute. Um, and again, I got a makeup stain on it and something else. I think um, I spilt curry somewhere <laughs> on my blushy. Like I said, I've literally, like, I've literally just got curry on everything. So yeah, those are all my plushies that I have. This is a really boring video. I shall see you later. Bye. And then, oh. No! Stay. Stay. Stay, girl, stay. Are you gonna stay? No!